Hi, I'm Imogenie with Imogenie Science and Magic, where science looks like magic until you understand. This episode is about paper topology. What happens to paper shapes when you twist and turn them? With us today are Imani, Tyrone, and Quinn. This is just a ream of paper. So how many sides does it have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Now if we take one piece of paper, how many sides does a piece of paper have? You want four. four. Show me the four. One, two, three. What about this and that? Five. Just like this is a stack of paper, we didn't lose any sides. We only, only got one sheet. This piece of paper right now, just like that big one, how many sides? Six. If we take two of these ends together, Now, how many sides? No. None. Oh, okay. we've got we've got this one and that one and one over here and one over here. We take two of the ends together, so they went away. We had six minus two. Six minus two is four. Four, exactly. Take the scissors and cut on this line. We've got two. Identical shapes. How many sides do each of these have? Two or eight. Eight, eight if you add them up, yes. If you add them up, four here, four here, we've got eight. Now we're going to get tricky. I'm going to be giving each of you your very own strip, but this time I'm going to give it one twist. Please use your marking pen to start drawing and don't stop till you meet where you started. Now, Tyrone, you're going to get two twists. Same thing. Take your marking pen and start drawing and don't stop until you need it. And Imani, you're going to get three twists. Here we go. One, two, three. Find your pen and don't stop until you need it. I'm going to draw my line on the edge instead of down the middle. This side is that side. You've got ink on both sides. This side seems to be the same as that side. Did it come through? Or? You got a heart, and did you have income? How many sides does yours have? Two. Two sides. So you think it's the same as, same as this one? I want you to cut on the lines that you drew. Let's just see what happens. You saw what happened when we cut that first one in half. It just made two identical loops. So let's see what happens when we cut these in half. Ever cut something in half before and get one? Mm, yeah. What, what else did you cut in half and get one? Well, I cut some paper and I got one. Uh huh. So this is twice as big as what you started with. Hmm? Tyrone, what did, what did you get? Two, yeah, two, uh, two identical loops. What do you think would happen if you cut one of them in half? They'll in they two will be Try it. And, and Where'd you get it, Imani? Two. Oh, you got the same thing I did. A little loop and the big loop. But you had three twists and I only had one. So it's like an odd number of twists gets us both the same thing. The paper one twist, tape it, then pick up a pen and draw a line and keep drawing until you meet where you started. What looks like two sides of the same paper is really the same side. Usually, when you cut something in half, you get two pieces. But watch what happens when you cut this loop with one twist. When you cut it in half, you get a big one. If you draw a line on this loop, you'll see it has two sides now. When you cut a one-sided loop in half, you get two sides. If you see something that looks like magic, design an experiment. See if you can make it happen again. This is Imogenie for Imogenie Science and Magic.